Happy birthday to you. It's actually my birthday and we're here to work. Well, yesterday was my birthday. Today's my actual birthday. Like we're having like an actual birthday day today at my house and Shadia wanted me out of the house. She's like, get the f out of here. Don't come back until I have everything prepared for you. So she's doing like a, a surprise party, but it's not really a surprise because I know that it's a surprise, but it's also not a surprise because it's not classified as a surprise, but it might still be a surprise. Like she might surprise me. In a way, it is a surprise because if I go there and I'm like, wow, then I'm actually surprised. And if that's the case, then it's a surprise birthday party, even though I know about it. Therefore, it's a surprise. So yeah, we're gonna go clear some new trails today in the forest. Hopefully we don't die. Hopefully the homeless guys aren't here today. I'm not taking any chances. Brought an ax and a machete. Also brought a power saw. This time it's charged. I think that's all I have for today. I think we're gonna do some renovations on the house as well. Like we're gonna put in a new kitchen. What? Yeah. Kitchen. Yeah. And cabinets. We're gonna put in a swimming pool. We're also gonna put in a trampoline. So we just made a discovery that every day we come here, we find something new on the property. So you guys know the stream. Um, there's like a, a little bridge here that we've never seen before. And this is the, the short path that these homeless guys take through here. So that's how they're getting across so easily. So like, wow. I say, dude, I say we like clear this up and we use it for ourselves. Yeah. You know what I mean? So we'd be able to actually go through here. We've, no, we've never noticed it because now all the leaves are completely dropped for the fall season. This is cool. I want to clean this up. Yeah. This would give us like maybe a third or fourth entrance. Yeah. It just makes it easier on us instead of going all the way around and then ending up into like the Blair Witch side of the forest. You guys know I call it the Blair Witch side because it looks creepy in there with all the cedar trees. This is my favorite thing to do, by the way. Clear trails and stuff because it's good exercise. And I love doing it. One hit. One hit, one hit. You're getting better at this, man. I think it's already dead. No, I think you're just like a better samurai now. Yeah. So much that. I don't wanna, I don't wanna kill this one. This one's alive, I think. Is it? I think so. No, it's dead. Yeah, it's good. Well, it's definitely dead now. <laughs> yeah. All right, you just made another bridge. Yeah, walk across that. Go ahead. <laughs> My machetes are so... Like, we've used and abused these machetes this year. We've seen better days. Easy! Everyone's been messaging me about saying, like, happy birthday, Mo. What are you doing on your birthday week? Honestly, I just like to film. I don't really do anything. Chad is doing like a, a birthday thing for me where family come over, but that's pretty much it. Like I don't really like to go above and beyond for birthdays. But I did tell Shadia that if I don't have like at least a birthday get together, then then we're done. <laughs> we're done. I'm just joking. I didn't say that. But yeah, I've been getting a lot of emails and messages from you guys saying happy birthday, Mo. And just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate it. This is cool. I'm enjoying this. Very therapeutic. And it's just made our life so much better and easier actually to go through this way. Then you go around the other way and it's like a longer distance. I'm just looking out making sure these guys aren't around. I'm gonna flap my drone in a little bit to see if these guys are around here. I don't think so, it's really early in the morning. They're probably on their like crack high. We still have no clue where they've been like sleeping, like actually sleeping. Like we found a bunch of campsites. We found a bunch of locations, so many of them where we assume they're sleeping, but it's almost like they rotate from place to place. So we don't know. And for all we know, they're probably sleeping somewhere not on our property, but they just come in through our property to access different areas around, right? Look at this. I 
hear the weird noise. It's very loud. Mo, what are you doing? Oh, well, you know, just cleaning up the place, making it easier for us to move around in here. That was like a monster, like <laughs> bashing things. All my machetes are so shit now. Look at this. Yeah. They're all <laughs> from the use and abuse. Still works though. Yeah. Ripped it off. Oh! There we go. I mean, they're all they're all dead. That was really cool. So I want to have like a nice safe path going like through here. And then there's another path that we're gonna clean up down that way. And I think we'll be set for for like safely walking or running if we have to through here. All right, this is looking cool. We actually have a new path. This way we don't have to go around the other way because it's much longer, more wet, and we are right here in the forest now you we used to come from that way there's still some trees that block in the ultra i'm gonna kind of like unblock them for now but now we can just go through here which is much easier and quicker save us more time if we have to chase after some homeless guys living in my damn forest i absolutely love being here like it's just so magical yes we've encountered a lot of resistance a lot of negative shit here but there's just something so beautiful about being here maybe that's what's drawing these nutcases to come and like attack me all the time and like take the shit over like because it's so magical and so beautiful and it just i just i don't know guys like just being here makes puts my mind at ease when i'm not almost dying like it's just very therapeutic and eventually the snow is going to be coming in and probably won't be able to come here when it's snowing it's going to be hard to walk around and see where we're walking and what we're walking on um you guys know like i've said in the past i am leaving the country for the winter but that might not happen until like mid-December now because you know I'm planning on doing some renovations at my my house over there and if they're not gonna be done in time then I might not be leaving until mid-December maybe even end of December so we'll see there might be a chance I might have to see some snow this year or pick up Shadia and Rania and we just go travel for a little bit until our house is ready I don't know we'll see <laughs> back to into where it belongs. Wow, look how big this tree is, look. You don't think I can carry it? Are you saying I don't have what it takes to carry a big tree? I think anything is possible. You ever seen that girl on TikTok? She carries like massive logs on her back. I don't have TikTok. I yeah. deleted my TikTok. Well, like I still have my account, but I deleted it because TikTok shadow banned me. Your life's just ticking away. Yeah, exactly. That's the whole point of TikTok. You're just wasting your life on it. YouTube, on the other hand, different story. You can build a teepee over here. I've been wanting to do that, to be honest. Like, do a video where we build a teepee in here and see who survives the night. But, like, it's just hard because these fucking guys are always coming out here. Heard that? Yeah. Stop it. That wasn't an animal. It sounded like someone was moving some wood around. Of course the ducks come, drown out the noise. I heard someone crunching on some, some branches. Yeah. It's just hard to hear right now with these f***ing ducks. Whatever, we'll keep working, see what happens. Let's go. <laughs> Break your back. I'm gonna come this way. Move. All right, I'm coming. I'm gonna come this way. I'm gonna snap it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That was awesome. That was a whole last treat. All right, morning exercise. One and two and three and four, five, six. Some Goku shit right here. Big time. All right, mom, coming home with some lumber.
You know what? I'm gonna start building a TP. I'm gonna add this to our TP, our TP fund. That's not safe. That's not gonna last. <laughs> yeah, this could be the start of our TP here. That, was... that kind of looks cool, man. Yeah, when it's done, it'll be cooler. Oh man, that was tiring. <laughs> that was looking crazy. You snapped the tree in half. And then you did pull-ups pull or whatever those are called. Shoulder presses. Shoulder presses. Yeah, you can tell I haven't been to the gym in a while. There you go. It's another addition to our CP. We went from building a trail to building TP. Let's go. You're just literally snapping trees in half. I'm technically putting these trees back to the way they were. This is how people, my ancestors did it. I'm still like all over the place. One minute I'm trying to build a trail. Next minute I'm building a bridge. <laughs> now, now building a TV. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like every time we hear some weird noise, we hear those pigeons come out. They're not pigeons, they're fucking geese. They're geese, they're pigeons. They're not whatever. pigeons. <laughs> Might as well call them flying raccoons. They are flying raccoons. Uh, all right, now the big kahuna. Now the big kahuna. I wonder if I can snap this one in half. Turn her around. Alright, let's do this. Better watch out, Moses. <laughs> yeah, this thing's strong, it won't break it now. Like, this is a big casually dragging the tree. Tree. <laughs> you can literally have a montage of da, 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 like a bunch of them breaking. <laughs> Watch your face. We're actually clearing the path to the old bridge over here. Oh, we're pretty much almost all clear. Yeah. Still one big log in the way. Good morning workout. There we go. Now we got a, a clear path. Yeah, it looks really clear. Yeah. Now we can actually ride our e-bikes in here. Or bikes instead of having to get off every two seconds. That's why I'm like clearing all these paths so we can just ride bikes and stuff. Oh, this is so magical. I'm taking a break, guys. I'm overheating. It's like it's supposed to be cold, but it's warm. But I don't want to take off my jacket because that's how you get sick. I don't want to get no flu. Dude, it's so nice just looking at these trees just swaying. <laughs> I'm getting a boner. <laughs> Is that gunshots? Oh look it's a squirrel. It's the first squirrel I've seen I've seen here. Alright, so far what I wanted to accomplish isn't done yet. We've basically accomplished some things, made some new things, but now what I would want to really accomplish is clearing up this path here. Because this path through here it's overgrown, a lot of branches and, and actual uh, trees have fallen. But if you look straight ahead, there's another very long path that connects with the other big side of the forest that leads to that other campsite that we found. And I want to clear this all up so we don't have to like jump over things. Because usually like when we come through here, you guys can see here, like you can't, it's hard to walk through here. And 
there's this tree in the way. Eventually when I cut all these down right now, we'll eventually have a nice clear path. We used to just go around this way, but now we'll have a clear path going forward that way. You can tell that there used to be a, a trail there back in the day. So we're gonna clear all this up. We're gonna clear all this up and it's gonna be nice and perfect. All right, let's do this. So I kinda wanna like keep this little opening here. It looks cool, but I might actually knock this tree down because it's dead. So we'll see. But I kinda like how it's like a doorway here. Yeah, it's maybe, kinda cool. Maybe we'll keep it as a doorway. Should have more juice than that. There we go. Damn, thing's strong. Ugh. There we go. There's something satisfying about cutting dead trees. Just like I'm like changing things around. This thing is still in the ground too. It's crazy. Wow, finally. This tree was still alive, to be honest. Because it literally has some green, but it, although it was down, it was still alive. Wow, that's cool. I didn't realize it had some greenery on it. Oh well, it's dead now. so hard to, to, to break wood that's dead and bouncing. We literally almost have a perfectly clear path. It's just little ones there. This whole damn tree had to fall right on the path. No harm was done to alive trees. I don't give a fuck. Funny, because I'm a guy that loves trees, but I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Oh, you're hurting the trees. I don't give a f <laughs> Oh no. The live tree is dead. I don't give a f Yes. <laughs> I learned how to do this from Minecraft. I don't give a f Mo was making fun of me because I was taking out like the little branches, the He's trees. sitting there hacking away at this little tiny branch. I'm like, do something bigger. Look at these. These literally have spikes in them. I was clearing it out. <laughs> so then it's a clear path. Look at how clean that place is. Wow. He's taking out the big ones. I was taking out the small ones. It's like... He was chewing away these like little branches. No, I was thinking if it was hitting me in the head on my way. <laughs> so yeah, you are tall, you are tall. I don't give a f <laughs> And we are pretty much done. Look at this, we can now walk through. If you guys remember before, you could not walk through this. And the trail just keeps going and going and going. Which oh, will make it easier. What? Well, there was another path like... Um, I guess because this one was blocked, whoever had this place before us was going this way and around to where the other second fort that we found um, is over there. But I don't like going through that area. I just like to go through this area here. So that one, we'll just re leave it closed for now until we decide to do something with it. Ugh, nothing to see here, just moving along. Question is, where are you moving it to? <clears throat> where am I moving to? You'll see. I'm making like a, like a doorway. It's to the other side of the forest. Why am I doing that, you ask? I have no idea. This one's a big one. This is going to look really intimidating when it's done. So the only way to get to our other trail is to go through this doorway. Eventually this is all going to be overgrown with bushes and shit. But I think it'll look cool when it's done. It's going to look cool and intimidating. Yeah, it's going to be amazing. This is actually cool. It actually looks so cool. <laughs> the only way to get through is to go through here and the thing collapses. <laughs> yeah. I like it, as my daughter would say. I like it, I like it. Yeah, this actually looks like an entrance to a base, you know? Yeah. 
I'll, I'll put more wood here. It's gonna look intimidating as fuck. So this way when the homeless guys show up, they're gonna be like, oh shit, these guys are being serious. They got wood. That was a dead one. Oh yeah. All right, I guess we're finished with this for now. See what I mean? Like we came here just to clean that one trail and then we started all these other random little projects after that. I just love doing this. It's so much fun. What did mommy do? Mommy made She made a happy do? <laughs> Guys, look at this. Shadi went all out for my birthday. She made me a cake over here. Look at this. It's got a king because I am the king apparently. And she made some cupcakes. These were all handmade by Shadia. And look at this. She decorated the wall for me. Our decoration Daddy, wall. This, this wall has actually come in handy throughout the years. Already. What are you doing? Already. You look really cute. Already. You still got to do your hair though. Me. Whoa. <laughs> Rana, you're looking cute. Can I see? Yes. <laughs> the crown? Yes. You want to wear that? Okay, there we go. All hail Queen Rania! Yes. <laughs> what? All hail Queen Rania! <laughs> that looks so cute on you. I want that. Why? That. What do you want to do with that? I want this. No, not right now. <laughs> Rhonda, there's no cake to blow out yet. Yeah, Rhonda's like, thinks it's her birthday. Is it your birthday or mine? Uh, birthday. Rhonda, whose birthday is it? Yours or mine? Our birthday. <laughs> Our birthday. Oh, you want a straw? Yes. You want, you want this? Yeah. That's what Ron is eyeing right now. You want this right here? Wow. Cool. It's a white <laughs> What? It's a white Can we just talk about how Shadia went all out today? Like, literally. She did this all day today while I was out filming on the property. And, uh, yeah, there's going to be more food. I got to go pick up a whole bunch of food that we're going to have here. Like, there's going to be some lamb. And there's going to be some, like, chicken. Oh, and we got cheese. Hi, Shadia. Can we just talk about all, all the stuff that you did? Yeah. All while I was out this morning? <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. You keep your hands off the cheese board, young lady. Okay? That's for the for the people. For guests. Okay? I want cheese this. Bro, what is all this? I like what you did. You did like a design right there. Shadia like made this cheese board. Slash meat oh, board. Oh, oh, gone wrong, gone wrong, gone. The, what, the board is so narrow, so like I'm oh. trying to... Like, what? What are you doing? Rania, what are you doing? Get up. <laughs> She's like, nope. Mmm, this looks so good. What you got going on here? We got cheese. Cheesy? And, and crackers and bread and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two. Raise her face. Be careful. Can you burn yourself? <laughs> <laughs>